Hello, welcome everyone to the MGM channel. We're here to talk about some game news. Age of the Empires have just got their gameplay trailer, and I gotta say, it's looking wonderful. Uh, the details of the uh, arena when you start off with, just like the classic, but a lot more beautiful, really. There is going to be over 200 units to use in one battlefield, which is fantastic. It's going to be the, the classic style of Age of Empires, get resources, build a base, build a village, etc, etc. There's going to be other eight different uh, empires to pick from, so that's another plus. But all I can see so far in this game, it's looking really good, and a lot of people are very excited for this. And the second news we want to talk about is a game called Enlisted. Uh, it is the makers from War Thunder and Casino Royale. Um, I believe this is going to have the same feel as a Casino Royale game, but more of a battlefield state. Um, from the trailer, it looked like you can fly planes, drive tanks, and all sorts. So it's going to have like, I, I think it's going to have that um, Casino Royale meets. Uh, War Thunder style, I, I, I think. Uh, we're going to be playing it this weekend on twitch.tv forward slash Games GamesNights and I'll maybe even make a review for you guys on that one. And finally, we're coming up to Dying Light 2. Now, it's been a very long time since we've heard anything from Dying Light 2. Uh, I believe Dying Light 2 was slated to launch in early 2020, but nothing happened at all. No, no news until the March update where they said they're working on it and they wanted to make everything look nice and get everything uh, there. Because at the end of the day, we don't want another cyberpunk. Dying Light 1, it was an absolute genuine good game. And it was, and I still play it today. And they have made so much DLC in that game. <laughs> I can't comprehend. The mods community is also fantastic as well. The coolest thing is that they recently had a Q&A. One of them said Dying Light 2's map was said to be four times bigger than the original game. If that is true, and it will, if it still is true, then this game's going to be absolutely insane. And if, if they're still going from what they used to go through, uh, with the city building, which means that whatever you do in the game, the, the city can evolve around, then we're in for a treat, boys. We are in for a treat. I do hope it's co-op, uh, because I, I spend most of my time of enjoyment out of that by playing co-op with a friend. So far, they speculated it to release this year, but who knows what happens. They might even delay it for another year. Uh, I can't promise anything, but if it's going to be this year, then I'm very hyped. And they've taken a long time and been very quiet about this. So tune in on the channel. Don't forget to subscribe to see reviews, game news, and all sorts of guides for different games. Don't forget to check out the website, mgn.gg this time. Uh, there's a new link on there. It will have loads of guides on different games like Valheim. And the, the team are working absolutely incredible there. So, yeah, go check it out.